In this video, we're going to learn about normalization in Adobe Audition. Now, here we have the recording um, of our intro file or intro sound file. And you can see the peaks and troughs of the sound wave. The peaks are the louder parts. Um, so the more volume there is, the higher these peaks are and the higher and lower the peaks are. So the problem is when you have multiple different recording sources, the volume will change between different ones. If I have someone who's a louder speaker, they'll actually have higher peaks. If I have someone who's a softer speaker, it's gonna be quieter peaks. Um, if you're getting music, for example, that may be higher as well too. So what you need to do is to do a process called normalization, which gets those peaks to be all the same height. Now we wanna actually bring it up so everything is as, so the loudest sound in here is the loudest point of volume up there. So this is the process we're gonna go through. Again, if you've got the file here, you can just double click to select the entire um, sound file. And I'm gonna then gonna go up to effects and I am going to go to amplitude and compression and come down to normalize process. And I'm gonna normalize it to 100%, which means the loudest sound here, which I think is about that one, will be right up to the very top. So let's go apply. And you see that it's now pulled it up to the top. So now we have a much louder sound. If I play it, it should sound louder. Welcome to the Totally Awesome Podcast. I'm your host, Damien Murta, and join me as we talk about everything which is totally awesome. So there we are, a much louder and clearer sound that's come through there. So that's how you normalize audio. You need to make sure that all of your sources, um, all your audio files are normalized, and that way your volume across them is gonna be a lot closer and a lot easier to mix when we go into the mixer.